How's it going, everybody? It's your boy, homie G, and I'm back. I know it's been a while, but here's my latest video, and it's all about you and your social life and whether or not you are a loser. Okay, so have you ever been stuck at home on a Friday night, Saturday night, no one's texted you to come do anything with them, no one's invited you to a party, to the movies even, or even just for a dinner? with a friend at some house. Uh, if that's you, regularly, meaning every Friday, Saturday uh, night, you might start to wonder, hmm, does this make me a loser? Am I a loser? Because no one's ever inviting me to go anywhere on a Friday night or, a, or Saturday night. Well, we got to put this into perspective, my little homies. First of all, you got to start asking yourself, why haven't people invited you to places? Yes, these days, many more kids are staying at home and watching Netflix uh, all night, whatever, uh, Friday night, Saturday night. And that's perfectly fine if that's what they want to do. Nothing wrong with that. That doesn't make them a loser per se, right? Uh, it's just what it's it's what's in nowadays, watching, um, streaming something on the TV. So you might want to consider certain things like, okay, well, what if you did get invited to a party or a get together where well, there's a lot of popular kids or kids at school who have more popularity than you um, and you end up showing up to this party and you start to notice that there's a lot of kids doing some sort of drug, whether it be vaping or smoking marijuana or uh, drinking alcohol, um, liquor, whatever, just kids going wild and going crazy. Let's say you were invited by some friends and your friends are uh, also, you know, partaking in this illicit behavior, uh, but you don't want to. So maybe because it's just not you. That's not how you've been brought up to use drugs or to, um, you know, to party this way. And it's, it's going to make you uncomfortable. So now, who's the loser in this situation? The kids? who are doing drugs, yes, they're having a good time, but they're stoned or they're out of their mind, right? Or you for having shown up, knowing that this was going to happen, knowing that it might make you uncomfortable and still remaining there at this party. Well, both, both those kids and you, because if you knew that that was going to be happening, Perhaps, and you know it might make you uncomfortable. Perhaps you shouldn't have shown up. Perhaps you should have stayed at home and watched that Netflix episode of All American or whatever, right? <laughs> okay, so, but what if you went to the party and you, uh, you've just found that kids were just having fun? Um, maybe some of them were doing drugs, but your friends weren't pushing you to do the drugs uh, or to be part of any of the illicit behavior, uh, and you just enjoyed yourself being there. Um, you know, because kids were socializing, talking to each other for once, not on their phone all the time, just having a good time. Well, then it was a good experience for you. And it was a good thing that you went. Okay, those are two scenarios, right? But what if you're never invited? Okay, I just mentioned that maybe you're not making yourself uh, uh, friendly enough to be invited at school, perhaps you not socializing with the right people, that also go out on outings on the weekend. Maybe you're just socializing with people that like to stay home. So you might have to find different friends at school. Um, but certainly, whether or not you're invited, or whether or not you're always invited and you don't show up, it doesn't really matter not being at a party every Friday night, every Saturday night, every weekend of the school year does not make you a loser. Okay? Don't feel bad about that. Uh, it's just, it's just the way it is. You're not always going to be invited to the things that are happening. Um, and I would just tell you to use that time productively. I know many of you want to just watch TV or play video games all night, whatever. I would just tell you to just make it a productive evening. Read something, learn something, get on YouTube and just learn about things that you might need in life. Uh, that your friends are not going to get a chance to um, experience because... Or, or view because now they're uh, they're partying. So you're going to use those hours productively and they're not. Okay, so don't consider yourself a loser because you're not always invited to places or to um, events. Um, if you are constantly never invited, then you have to ask yourself, why are you 
hanging out with the right people and are those are the right people that will invite you to uh, uh, situations or events that are not going to be uh, dangerous or risky for you. And if so, those are probably good friends. I would keep them. Uh, if not, I would uh, not continue to hang out with those people um, because you don't need the drama. You don't need the problems that could come from uh, environments like this, okay? Whether that be getting hooked on a drug um, because you tried something or uh, just getting caught because, you know, you weren't supposed to be, but your parents found out. So it's just more problems, right? So better off staying at home. Okay, so you're not a loser if you're not ever invited to Okay, maybe you are a loser. <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. I was kidding. No, you're not. Um, honestly, I wasn't invited to places all the time. So look at me. I'm super cool now. I'm homie G. Did it matter? No, it doesn't matter because high school doesn't matter when it comes to social life. Okay, college does because you can network there and find people that are going to potentially give you jobs in the future uh, if you end up um, meeting the right the right people, right? So networking does matter in college, but in high school, nobody cares that you're not um, the most popular person at every party at every Friday night or Saturday night. In the end, in the end, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter one bit because you can still become rich and wealthy and have a great time with your life after high school, which is what most adults do. Yes, yeah, some party way too hard in high school and they pay the price after that okay so that's all i gotta say my little homies you're not a loser if you're not going out every friday night or saturday night stay chill relax enjoy your life don't sweat the the small stuff don't sweat all that nonsense peace